Hey guys, welcome back to my channel, David Madison the Guardian. So let us see if we can move this right here. There we go. There we go. Now I've talked before about leaning in and leaning out. There's that. There's also, when I stand back here, when I was standing up close, I wasn't feeling the energy. So what did I do? I didn't actually step in to try to work at it harder. I stepped back. That's because I believe that we there's an energetic grid system in the universe and there are certain spots that you can go to on this planet where the energy is kind of just more connected there's there's more energy going through right so you, there are things called ley lines dragon lines and sometimes when I'm trying to connect what I'll do is I'll step back until I feel like a current of air and that tells me that I'm in a spot where energy is moving it's strange right and perhaps that thing shifts back and forth who knows but it's another way that I found to connect to things. Because sometimes all it takes is that to step back. Until step back, step to the side till you find till you find that energy. And then you can use that, right? Now these are this is really thick stuff here. It's kind of prickly. And it's it's like it's dry. It's not it's not leafy, right? It's short, it's stubby. It tends to be really hard to move. But that's only if you believe that. Once you've gotten really good at this kind of thing, you can move just about anything, um, at least bush-wise, right? So now, now that we've got some energy going, let's see if we can not get this rock to rock back and forth on here. I'll tell you, one guy who really surprised me, even though he's really good telekinetic, it still kind of blew me away what he was able to do. 
Um, his channel is called The Journal of the Jedi. And he was able to get a rock, like a big freaking honking rock that was up on a ledge and it was standing up. And he was able to just knock it over. There we go. All right, let's see. So one of the things that I'm doing is I'm not just concentrating on it, but I'm doing this thing where I'm shifting my energy this way, then my energy this way, then a little bit this way, then a little bit this way. Inside my head though, right? So my focus is kind of like coming over here, then coming over here, then coming over here, just slightly. And <clears throat> if you've ever rocked a car that gets stuck, you press on it and then you wait for it to come back at you and you press on a little bit harder, wait for it to come back at you, and then press on it a little bit harder. It's it's kind of it's kind of that feeling until you find the tempo of because everything has a tempo that it rocks back and forth when it's on a balance point. And you can slow down and speed up that tempo until it matches and, and so you'll kind of bump into the rock then you'll then you'll then you'll because you've bumped into the rock the molecules in the rock are going to shift over and then because everything seems to be kind of elastic in the matrix okay it's got this elastic quality to it. It's, it's strange. But just think about like the car, right? And the trick is to find the direction. So right now, the direction is across this bar, but it, you know, depending on what it is, it may also be that it rocks a little bit this way, if it's imbalanced that way. So you've got to find where's the imbalance. You sense into that. Got a little bit going. There we go. Got a little bit of it going. All right, this is kind of a long video. I don't want it to be any longer than 10 minutes for right now. so like subscribe and share and uh, make sure you click on the bell icon to be notified when more videos like this show up and until next time my friends peace love and light be well